Good morning. Like and subscribe if you wish. <clears throat> now let's get straight to it. In the last video, I explained what religion is. Religion is the recognition of the indwelling spirit of God within us. And once we recognize the indwelling spirit of God within us, we must develop it. And by developing it, I mean manifesting it by becoming our brother's keepers. If we become our brother's keepers, there is no need for war and a waste of human resources. Now, I want to get straight into the subject matter. Yahshua, as you know, or should know, was not a racist. Yahshua also believed in integration. Segregation is a judgment. Je segregation is a judgment which deems certain people as being unworthy. It judges people as being unworthy. And we know what Yahshua said. Let he who is without sin cast the first stone, which means don't judge others if you are not perfect. And the only person that is perfect is God, the Father. I suggest that you read Matthew 7, verse 1. For it states, Judge not that ye be not judged. Let's go to Matthew 7, verse 5, which I think is very interesting. Thou hypocrite, first cast out the beam of thine own eye, and then shalt thou see clearly to cast out the moat out of thy brother's eye. In other words, get yourself right with God before you call yourself getting someone else right with God. Don't judge others. Racism is a judgment. Segregation, once again, is a judgment. And any religion that preaches segregation is blasphemous. I like to draw your attention to a great man, Louis Farrakhan. He talks of segregation, but he is the progeny of integration. And when he talk, when he speaks out about integration, he is being a hypocrite. Would you believe and agree with me that any mixed race man that speaks out against integration is a hypocrite? Mark 2 verse 16 and 17 further proves that Jesus was not into segregation. Beginning verse, Mark 2, beginning verse 16. And when the scribes and Pharisees saw him eat with publicans and sinners, they said unto his disciples, How is it that he eateth and drinketh with publicans and sinners? When Jesus heard it, he saith unto them, They that are whole have no need of the physician, but they that are sick, I came not to call the righteous, but sinners to repentance. He did not call the righteous, 
to repent. He went to the sinners. He integrated himself. He ate with sinners. He integrated himself. He did not look at them and judge and not integrate with them. He integrated with sinners. He didn't judge them as good or bad. He was his brother's keepers. I'm going to end with Luke 8, 2021. 20, I'm not going to read it. I'm going to paraphrase it because I love it so much. When Jesus' mother and brother came to visit him and they knocked on the door because they could not get in to see him and they sent message that his brother and his mother or sister were at the door. Yahshua replied, my mother, my sister, and my brother are those who believe in my father are those who believe in my father stop referring to god as allah jehovah what have you refer to god as the father god is the father of humanity and we should refer to God as the father and as nature as the mother God the father nature the mother this is spirituality this is spiritual consciousness I will end here like and subscribe if you please god bless have a nice day